Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with a Sassigar Aroma haul. Um, so I wasn't going to order. <laughs> I always say that. Um, and then somebody tagged me in the restock post because two scents I really wanted were being restocked. Um, one of them I missed out on last month because when I ordered the two chunk bags I ordered, it was like a week after restock. They were long gone. And the other scent she tagged me in, I really wasn't buying because I have like two loaves in that scent but I did find enough to make it worth buying um there were a few chunk bags I wanted and a few of the little donut and cookie ones that I wanted so I wanted placing three orders so I've now discovered she does send you one sample per, per order so um she does combine shipping she charges you 50 I think it's 50 cents per order um for combined and but she does send one sample per order and she invoices you for shipping later so you pay just exact shipping. So the first sample that I have is cola. Smells just like cola. The second one I have is appleberry and I'm trying to do this quick because my kids are upstairs and they are starting to become unhinged. And then cashmere and silk. I can hear them arguing. So all right so I did pick up one of her unicorn shapes and caramel macchiato which is caramel vanilla and coffee so cute so the, her stuff did come very smudged it was pretty hot out so that's why i have for all for all intents and purposes i basically stopped buying because of that i've been very picky who i am buying from right now because of that there is one uh vendor i'm gonna buy from this week and that is it i haven't bought in over a week now uh, the last thing i bought was this stuff on saturday it was what the 22nd something like that okay then I got some cookies and donuts. So the first thing that I got is Goodnight Sweetheart, which is pink sugar, sweet lavender birthday, cotton candy frosting. I love this scent. It is a super, super nice bedroom scent. Aren't these the cutest little things? I kept calling these the donuts, and then one of my friends was like, you idiot, <laughs> those are the cookies. And I'm like, yeah, that's right. They don't even look like, th th they look like the donuts that I used to get. <laughs> So the next one that I got is cinnamon sugar donut type and it's fresh crushed, fresh crushed cinnamon blended with sugar crystals on top of a fresh donut. This one I'm saving for fall. I love cinnamon sugar donut from like Bath and Body Works in the fall. Oh, so good. Yep. I'm putting that in my fall box. All right. The next one that I picked up is Tahiti Island Dreams, Mandarin, Coconut Water, Kiwi Blossom, Frangipani, Vanilla, and Musk. So I did just finish a Tahiti Island Dreams body spray from Bath & Body Works, and I will say this smells almost identical. This does, it does, it, it smells identical. It is so good. I love that scent so much. And then the last of the little things I picked up is espresso ice cream, which is cream, coffee bean, and vanilla. Y'all know I love my coffee. Mm, so good. I love coffee. All right. The rest of these are chunk bags. So I went in at first. We were still in Florida when the restock hit. And it happened to hit at a really good time. So we had been taking breaks in between um, going out to the ocean and being in the pool and hanging out in the room. Because it got really hot really early in Daytona. So... The restock hit at a time where I was actually, we were just hanging out. And I'm just going to take these out of here because I know he's going to fight me for this box. Even though it is just a regional A and fat boys do not fit in regional A boxes, he's going to try anyway. So don't act like you're not interested in this box. <laughs> so I did pick up, it looks like I have eight chunk bags here. So I didn't realize I bought so much, but I did do three orders. I bought like four chunk bags the first order and then I went back in for like you know, one or two here and there. So the first one that I have is Orca Island. It's Blackberry Beach Nights and Birthday. And these are, these became very messy too because it was so hot out. So I love her chunks. There's so many different colors. She's got the chunks and the overpour. And he did, he tried to fit his fat booty in this regional A box. Cracks me up every time. The next one, this was kind of a wild card for me. It's Bonfire Birthday. Bonfire can tend to be a little too much, but with the birthday, I was hoping it would be doable. It's Bonfire and Marshmallows Cotton Candy Birthday Cake. 
and this one's very colorful. This one reminds me of Disneyland with how colorful it is because I know when she does Disneyland, it's super colorful. And this is heavier on the bonfire, but I think that birthday cotton candy and marshmallow will come out a lot better um, when it's melting. The next one I picked up is Sitting Pretty, which is blueberry, strawberry, cotton candy, Satsuma. I know everybody voted and loved the idea of these, but I miss the regular chunk bags. I know um, Jessica D has mentioned it too. And this one's super good. This is very fruity. You definitely get that strawberry and that Satsuma. And I do get a hint of that blueberry. All right, and then the next one's Baby Bop, which is Strawberry Zucchini Noel. I love strawberry and I love zucchini. And my kids are starting to argue, so I'm trying to finish this fast. That smells super good. I haven't even gotten to the two that I meant to buy. <laughs> Sweet Fuji, Fuji Apple Sweet Lavender Marshmallow. I think I got something similar to this back when I was buying from her in 2016 and 17, and it was super good. Oh, I love it. Oh, all right. The next one is Romantic Interlude, which is Beach Nights Zucchini Blueberry Noel. I'm really getting into zucchini or blueberry and wax, so I searched blueberry on the site, and that's why I bought a couple with blueberry because I searched the site and it came up. I love the search function when the restock happens. You can just boom, right, go to what you need. All right, the last two are the ones that I had meant to buy. I really regret not buying two of each, but I need to kind of get a hold of myself. So the first one is IHOP, pumpkin, pumpkin pecan waffles, maple syrup, and brown sugar, caramel coffee. I do have several IHOP blends. I have this one, I have that, what's it, the third day? I think it was that had like sugar cookie and IHOP. I have Invisible Guest that has IHOP. And then I got Boot Scootin' from Courtney. That is a huge part of, I think, a loaf that has IHOP. So I have plenty of IHOP blends. But I love it so much. I love that pumpkin pecan waffle mixed with that coffee. It is so damn good. So I am kind of upset I only got one bag. But I'm like, okay, I have enough IHOP blends to get me through. And I'm on an extreme low buy. But although I'm on an extreme low buy, I am still picking up my favorites. So I do have my favorites in mind from each vendor that I buy from. And I will just pick up as I get low on them or as they're restocked. And the last thing is Radiant Red Maple. This one I put an ISO up when I started buying from her again. And she restocked it. It's Macintosh Apple Woody Caramel Smoky Notes and Sweet Maple. This is amazing. This is going to go in my fall box. It is so good. I definitely get that caramel and the apple and it's so amazing together so I'm super glad that I wound up getting that. This is what I meant to get last month and then I it was gone before I wound up uh, grabbing it so all right so that is everything for this haul I will be back I won't have any more hauls I don't have anything outstanding actually so um, I will be back with my regular what I've melted each week and I will talk to y'all later. Bye.